Caitlin Clark electrified the Indiana Pacers playoff atmosphere, setting the Gainbridge Fieldhouse abuzz with anticipation as she revved up a replica Indy car before Game 3 against the Milwaukee Bucks. She also signed perhaps the strangest autograph of her career before leaving the arena, welcoming the youngest fan to the Indiana Fever. A fan asked Clark to autograph a laminated picture of her ultrasound. Without hesitating, Clark smiled and signed the picture. The WNBA's top draft pick in Division I's all-time leading scorer made her first public appearance on the court since being drafted by the Indiana Fever, igniting a wave of applause from the nearly 17,000 fans in attendance. As Clark, accompanied by her new Fever teammates, took to the court to distribute t-shirts during halftime, veteran guard Erica Wheeler expressed the team's aspirations, declaring their playoff ambitions. With Clark's arrival, the Fever are poised for a resurgence, aiming for their first playoff appearance since 2016. Clark's impact extends beyond the court, already transforming the Fever into one of the WNBA's hottest tickets. Her college career at Iowa was marked by sellout crowds and record television ratings, foreshadowing the Fever's newfound popularity in Indiana. Ticket sales have surged, prompting some teams, like the Las Vegas Aces, to relocate home games to larger venues in anticipation of Clark's debut. The 22-year-old sensation arrived in Indianapolis for an introductory press conference on April 17th before returning home to Iowa with her family. However, she was back in town to support the Pacers during their first home playoff game in three years. Clark's journey with the Fever officially begins when training camp kicks off on Sunday. After a two-game preseason slate, Indiana will begin the 2024 campaign with a matchup against the Connecticut Sun on May 14th. Aaliyah Boston and Clark will become one of the league's most powerful duos. The number one pick started the rise that the Fever are currently on. Despite some veteran WNBA players insisting that Clark will not find it easy in the WNBA because she will be playing grown women and not the 18-year-old college girls in the NCAA, Aaliyah Boston has proved that it is possible to come out of college and excel in the WNBA. Coming out of South Carolina as a National Player of the Year and NCAA champion, she was an all-star starter and the unanimous pick for Rookie of the Year, averaging 14.5 points and 8.5 rebounds in 2023. Amidst the excitement of her professional debut, Clark found time to enjoy the NBA playoffs from the sidelines, cheering on her boyfriend, Connor McCaffrey, a team assistant for the Pacers. McCaffrey, a former athlete himself, shares Clark's alma mater, the University of Iowa. The couple celebrated their one-year anniversary with heartfelt social media posts, reflecting on their journey together and expressing excitement for the future. McCaffrey's unwavering support was evident at the 2024 WNBA draft, where he stood by Clark's side as she was selected as the number one overall pick by the Fever. Joining them were Clark's parents and brothers, underscoring the significance of the moment as she embarks on the next chapter of her basketball career. As Clark prepares to make her mark in the WNBA, her presence has already galvanized fans and teammates alike, setting the stage for a thrilling season ahead for the Indiana Fever and their dynamic rookie sensation.